What's happening, YouTube? Another wild situation that I got for you guys right here, right now. But look, man, you see that like button right there, player, player? It don't cost you nothing. All you got to do is tap the like button. You see that subscribe button right there? I know you see it. If you ain't subscribed yet, bro, what is you doing? Hit that subscribe button. It's free. I don't want your EBT card. I don't want your wick. I don't want you to do nothing. Like, you know what I'm saying? You ain't got to pay no fee. It's free. Just go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Player, don't be a hater. Let's go. So this video is going to be about YouTube drama spilling out to the streets. Is that possible? Could it happen? Could YouTube drama get you into a wreck? Could it get you into something you don't want to be involved with, man? Let's talk about this. Let's have this conversation. Because you see YouTube drama going on all the time, bro. In regards to channel versus channel. And big channels, too. I'm talking about platforms. You know what I'm saying? Big platforms going at it, dissing each other. Sometimes you don't know if it's for clout. Sometimes you don't know if it's orchestrated between the two channels just to get the views up. Sometimes you don't know. Then you see the littler channels going at it. The smaller channels go taking shots at each other, calling each other out each other's names, talking about each other's families. Woo -woo -woo. You know what I'm saying? Some of these dudes get really disrespectful. For what? <laughs> I got it. Like, come on, bro. Is it really that serious, my nigga? Like, come on, knock it off, bro. I stay out of all the YouTube beats. I don't give a fuck. What you say about me, I don't... You could call me a punk-ass bitch. You this, that, and the third. I don't care. I'm not responding to none of you niggas. You could say whatever you want. I don't give a damn, bro. You know what I'm saying? Honestly, I don't. I don't care. So I'm not going to respond. But I see all these other channels going back and forth with each other, and I'm just like... God damn, bro. Why do you even care, my nigga? You don't know that, man. He doesn't know you. You guys are from two totally different cities, miles and miles apart. You're probably never, ever, ever, ever going to see each other. Who gives a fuck what that nigga says, bro? Like, come on now, man. This is the internet. Who gives a fuck what people say about you? If you know who you are, your peoples know who you are, those around you know who you are, then who gives a fuck what trolls say? You know what I'm saying? Even if they're not trolls, the other man that has a YouTube channel, like, who cares, bro? Like, he just talking. And nine times out of ten, they're clout chasing off your channel. You know what I'm saying? Like, let them get some clout off you. Fuck it. That's the way I look at it, my nigga. If someone going to talk shit, then fuck it. They want to get some clout off my channel, whatever, clout chase. Give a fuck, get cloud chase, my nigga. I don't give a fuck. You know what I'm saying? Say all you want about the kid, nigga. It's nothing, nigga. This shit ain't going to affect me or my channel or affect my pockets, bitch. I still got like a regular job, nigga. Like, you know what I'm saying? You guys can't take this internet shit serious. You know what I'm saying? And then not even just with YouTube channels, bro. Rappers, too. Like, niggas really get invested in rap beef, homie. Like, with the shit between Mr. Capone and SPM. Like, niggas really get invested into these rap beefs. And start thinking they are part of the, that rap beef. Like Swifty Blue versus this other dude. Like, you know what I'm saying? Motherfuckers be really invested into the rap beef. Mozzie versus CML. Biggie versus Pac. Like, nah, like, you feel me? Like, come on, bro. You do not know these dudes. You're not from their hood. You're not from their city. You're not from their section. You're not a blood. Like, nigga, knock it off. You're not a crip. Like, you know what I'm saying? You're not a south side or whatever. Now, I get it. You're invested because you spend money. Maybe you bought their album. You listen to their music on the daily. Or you watch their YouTube channels on the daily. So you fuck with them. You feel like, you know what I'm saying? You're part of that, that you know what I'm saying? That crew of... I don't fucking know what it is, homie. But don't waste your motherfucking energy on something you have no control over, bro. That's the end of the story, my nigga. Do not waste your energy on something you have no control over. Because it's just going to eat you up. It's just going to fuck with you. And if you allow it to do that, then that's your fault. That's your bad. If you allow something on the internet to stress you out, then you're already losing, my boy. They already got the upper hand on you. They are already winning. Don't let that shit get to you, my nigga. If a rapper diss you in a rap song, then you got to go slide on they block. That's the only way to end now. I'm just going to keep it a honey. Just going to slide on the sucker block. No, I'm just playing. No, no, no. This channel does not promote any violence. That was a joke. I don't recommend any sliding on any sucker's blocks whatsoever. That's just my little two cents on that. You know what I'm saying? Also, we got some dope interviews coming out very soon. If you guys haven't been to go check out the old ones I have posted already, go check out those interviews. It's going to be under the interview tab on my playlist section of this channel. As well, if there's any artists that you guys feel I should interview, let me know in the comments section. 
or hit me up on Instagram at underscore AWS underscore official. It's the kid and I'm gone.